You are with the designer of the new Kia Forte. Uh, that was a big challenge because the past one was really good and actually all the Kia cars lately have been really good uh, design-wise. So what was the big challenge to, to come up with this new car? Well, thanks for the, uh, the comment on the previous Forte. I, I worked on that one as well, but for the, next, for the new one, we really wanted to um, make it more emotional, more sculptural, and sleeker overall. So you can see how the, the roof blends in more with the hood and the trunk for a speedier profile. And there's a lot more sculpting. There's a lot more kind of finesse in the surfacing. The previous Forte was very geometric, yeah. clean, architectural. But for this one, we wanted more of a handcrafted feeling, like someone had been working the surface and massaging it and um, just has that extra um, feeling of um, sophistication. Uh, would that be correct if I say that uh, modern cars are looking more than past concept cars? I mean, like, the gap is closing. That's what I'm trying to say, right? That's like, the plan. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the plan is to basically so right show cars for the road. Yeah, <laughs> oh, of course. Yeah. And uh, our, our timelines are tightening so much that we're able to get uh, more of a futuristic look in, in road cars now. Yeah. And uh, as I said, the competition is tough, not only within your brand, but, like, other manufacturers are coming up with cars that are more attractive, more futuristic looking right. and there are production cars already so it's uh this is out already but uh you're i'm sure working on something else we, for we the future. are always working and we're very busy working on all a lot of new models right now and next year we're going to have i think they said something like seven new models so it's just it's an onslaught one after the next um keeping it fresh keeping it modern yeah another thing that uh, is interesting to me it's uh how technology i don't want to say interferes but like work works together with designing because technology is moving even faster than design. So how, how, how's that process goes? Yeah, it, it's difficult because, um, you know, with, with these, these two cars shown here, the uh, Forte and uh, the Sorento, um, they have the Uvo Incorporation, yeah. um, which helps to integrate your smartphone. So in that way, it can keep up with uh, the latest technology um, with your handheld device. So that's one way that, um, you know, we can, we can keep up with technology. Um, we have the LED uh, headlamps and posi uh, the position lamps, so we have that as well. Yeah, um, and another thing, I was talking to one of your colleagues on Hyundai, and um, he, he presented the Veloster convertible. Mm -hmm. You guys are really young. I mean, how, how it's very inspiring um, to, to a lot of, of people in the industry, but also to kids, like, because yeah. like you were saying, these are like concept cars on the road, and yeah. like, I want you to give a, a little input to kids who... Uh, would like to get into the auto industry. There's a shortage of engineers and designers for the auto industry. So can you share some of your experience and yeah. how well, to encourage more people to do this? I was lucky because my high school art teacher uh, told me about uh, you know a school to go to for car design, the art center. And um, you know for car design, that's you know that place or uh, CCS in Detroit are yeah. places you can go. But um, you know I've always loved drawing and I'm super passionate about cars too. So for me, it was a perfect fit. And, uh, yeah, if kids are out there now that want to pursue this career, there's, uh, there's a lot of opportunity, both in the engineering side and design side. Yeah, and cars are not going to disappear in the near future. I don't think right? so, no. <laughs> People like their own space, and um, it's just it's, uh, it's so convenient uh, to get around. Well, congratulations on the car. It looks fantastic, and I can't wait to drive it. I think I get the opportunity next month. Oh, great. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Esto es Autos 060 y como les digo siempre, no quiten la vista de la carretera y mantengan los oídos en Autos 060. Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting.